Hey, it's Dorian, aka your flick chick. I threw on my superhero cape over the weekend and headed off to the Bangor Mall Cinemas to see Marvel's Avengers The Age of Ultron. This is a long movie. It is two hours and 20 minutes, rated PG-13 for some intense sequences of action and destruction and a little bit of language. Of course, it stars your favorites, Mark Ruffalo, Robert Downey Jr., Scarlett Johansson, Chris Hemsworth, Chris Evans as your favorite characters, Captain America and Tony Stark and Black Widow and David Banner, the Hulk and so on. This is a continuation where uh, basically the Avengers as a group sort of get their butt handed to them. And Tony Stark says, you know what, our biggest threat doesn't come from the Earth anymore. It comes from outside the Earth. And so therefore, he and David Banner, or the Hulk, decide to reboot his Ultron project, which is a sort of um, artificial intelligence, but it's using a piece of alien technology. And uh, it sort of takes over and becomes the nemesis in this particular film. I won't give you more than that because more than that would give it away, but I can tell you this much. Uh, I liked about this movie the fact that, sort of like Bugs Bunny, you remember how Bugs Bunny always had a lot of action for the kids, but then there was some adult humor in there that would go right over their heads. This is very much like that. A lot of humor in this movie, great characters we've come to know and love. The downside of this movie is the fact that it goes on forever, honestly. Some of these battle scenes, uh, they're just, you know, so much crash and bang and crash and bang. And eventually, yeah, been there, done that scene. It got the t-shirt. Let's move on and get to the story part, right? I mean, I think I was even nodding. Don't tell anybody that. Just a tad during some of these really, really overdone action sequences. However, outside of that, the story was good. It, it sets you up for the next movie. And on a scale of 1 to 10, I am going to give Marvel's Avengers Age of Ultron a seven. So that's my spin on the new Marvel movie. If you would like to see the trailer, scroll down below and be sure to uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel so you get all my flick chick reviews right off the bat. Till next week, I'm Dorian Daniels.